everybody, we're Dan and handicapping thoroughbred racing on Friday afternoon, April 8th, 27th. This is my Echo Base Winter Circle Major Track Report. Opening day at beautiful Belmont Park, Elmont, New York. Let's check out race 3, 2.04 p.m. Eastern Post Time. A mile test on the dirt track. Three year olds race for an optional claiming prize of some $77,000. Contenders number two, Gowana Star Duige, number three, Unstoppable You, number six, Ship Shape, and number five, Charlie's Quest. Number two, Gowana Star G's is the overall speed leader in this optional claiming field, racing at today's distance of a mile on the dirt. Has hit the board in four straight with his last three board hit efforts, including a win to break his maiden in his last start, also qualifying as power runs. Number three, Unstoppable U, comes off a maiden breaking power run, winning his first asking 26 days ago at nearby Aqueduct Racecourse. Jockey Junior Alvarado was in his irons for that win, which produced a positive 225% return on investment in the process. Back here today at Belmont Park for a second ride, gunning for back to back circle trips. Race three summary number two, Gowana Star Duige, tops my contenders list, which also includes number three, Unstoppable U. Number three, Ship Shape, and number five, Charlie's Quest, 2365 in the third from Belmont Park. Let's go to Keeneland for their feature Elkhorn Stakes, 12 furlongs on the turf, grade two, four year olds, and up race for $150,000. Contenders number four, News Dad, number one, Musketeer. Number five, Simard, and number nine, Center Divider. Number four, News Dad, the overall speed leader in his stakes field racing at or about today's distance of 12 furlongs on the dirt. It's hit the board in four straight with his last three efforts, including a pair of wins also qualifying as power runs. Number one, Musketeer has produced power runs in three straight, hitting the board in four, both of his last two outings, including a power run win in his second race back. Race nine, Summary. Number four, News Dad, tops the contenders list today, which also includes number one, Musketeer, number five, Simard, and number nine, Center Divider, 4159 in the ninth today from Keeneland, the $150,000 grade two Elkhorn stakes. Finally, let's go to Pimlico in Baltimore, race 8, 426 p.m. Eastern Post Time, eight and a half for a long route test on the dirt, three year olds, and up race for $35,000 allowance prize. Contenders number five, Olympist, number six, Parody, number one, Tapping into Victory, and number four, Hint. Number five, Olympus, the overall pace profile leader in this allowance field, racing at or about today's distance of eight and a half furlongs on the dirt, has hit the board in power run fashion in four of his last five, including back-to-back -back power run wins in his last two starts. Number six, Parody, the overall speed leader in this field, has produced a trio of power runs in his last five adventures, hitting the board in a pair. Jockey Abel Castellano and trainer Jamie Ness sent him to the post. They've hit the board with an impressive 65% of more than 250 entry saddles a team to date. Race 8 summary, number 5, Olympus, tops the contenders list today, which also includes number 6, Parody, number 1, Tap it into victory and number four hint five six one four in the eighth from Pimlico. Bonus long shots Finger Lakes race six number two note the smoke four to one shot takes an eight level class drop nice speed for this four and a half for a long sprint. Hawthorne race course race number two the nine to two shot number eight thief takes an eight level class drop the overall speed leader in this claiming field tonight sprinting at or about. Six and a half furlongs on the dirt. So handicapping from Belmont on opening day, Keeneland as they're almost closing, and Pimlico in Baltimore on a Friday with needed for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.